Okay, so the final game of the group stages was played off stream. It was Dark Zero against Damwon Kia. Dark Zero won 7 2. This game was deciding who would be first seed and who would be second seed from the group. Winner got first, of course, uh, and the loser got second. So Dark Zero won, so they're first seed. So the first seeds were from Group A, Team BDS, from B, Space Station, C, Dark Zero, and D, Liquid, and the second seeds from each group were uh, from Group A, Team 1, from Group B, Furia, from Group C, Damon Kia, and from Group D, Empire. So it was, I guess, randomly arranged, or I'm not sure how this was determined, other than each first seed played one of the second seeds. So this is the bracket, and I mean, I guess while I'm at it, I'll just guess who's going to win. I think the, the best four teams have looked like the teams that got the first seeds. Uh, Space Station, Liquid, and BDS look really good, especially Liquid, who I think only dropped the one game to TSM, and that game didn't matter. So I, you know, they, if you if you watch that game, especially, you know, they were just trolling in the first round, and then it seemed like they were kind of trying to win, but it, the game really didn't have stakes, uh, so it didn't matter. To them too much, and I assume that's why they lost. Uh, so I'm going to have to take Liquid here over Damon Kia. They might have been been the team that really put... Oh, well, I guess uh, not the only team, but they were one of the teams that took it to Nip. Nip, I think I think Nip actually lost to G2 twice and Damon Kia twice, and they beat Dark Zero twice, so interesting turn of events, but uh, still not good enough to beat the indomitable-seeming Liquid. Dark Zero versus Team 1. I'm going to have to take Dark Zero here. They look really good, surprisingly good. Nobody expected, almost nobody expected per this this performance from him at the Major. Although, I don't it could go to Team 1. Like, they are on an absolute roll now with the, the string of games they had to win to qualify and the under the circumstances that they specifically had to do to make it. They had to, yeah, I covered this in the last video, but they had to win, and then they had to win without losing more than two rounds, and then because they lost exactly two rounds, they had to play a tiebreak. And they, they did everything I had to. I'm still going to take Dark Zero here, but I wouldn't be surprised to see Team 1. Space Station over Empire, I mean, I, I hope something crazy doesn't happen. Empire looked pretty good, but, I mean, Space Station, they faltered a little bit, but they're so clutch, they're so they're so tightly knit, they're, they're so good. If all of their players can show up, and they've, they've had some, you know, Rampy's been a little bit slow in some games, thinking it hasn't had the best performance, but again, you know, on the hard support, it's whatever. Uh, and Hot and Cold hasn't been as hot as he was in NAL, but but Bosco and Foltz have looked really good. And if the other three members can just up it a little bit, I, I mean, I think they, they might win the whole thing, but I'm going to take Space Station. And then BDS over Furia. I mean, Furia made it, but all of their wins were, were, in, uh, were in round 15, right? They beat uh, Navi twice in overtime at round 15, and they beat SSG once. So, I mean, you know, win's a win, I guess, but BDS didn't struggle too much. They they mopped the floor with Sonics twice. They beat Cyclops twice, right? And they beat Team 1 once, so I think they only lost the one game, Team 1. Uh, they look really good, and I'm going to have to take BDS. And then it gets a little bit more interesting. Space Station versus BDS, I mean, I don't, I don't know. I, I saw Pengu was saying that he thought Team BDS and uh, Liquid were the two front runners by far like they were a step above i'm gonna take space station i think uh bds might be hot right now but i th i think space station take and i certainly want them to take it you know it's my it's been my favorite team for years oh so, you know a little bit of bias there but still i i think space station take it i think i think their strategies are just deeper and they have equal if not better gun skill i mean bds has shiko but you know probably everyone on on space station is well i mean you know rampy and bolts have been known for a long time as insane gunners and hot and cold has proved himself over the last two NAL seasons to be great. He didn't he didn't uh, play much much in the way of fragging for the last few years, but now that he's on these roles, he's doing incredibly well. I'll take Space Station to the finals. And then over here, Dark Zero versus Liquid, you know, as much as I want an NA team to win whenever possible. Uh, I'm gonna take Liquid again. They look really good. And then in the final so Liquid versus Space Station, this is a true best of five. There's no map advantage or anything. I think I mean, again, I said I'm biased. I'm going to take Space Station. This is, Maybe it's wrong. Um, Liquid look really, really good. Uh, but these have all been best of one so far. And maybe I'll change my prediction after seeing the first round. But I'm going to take Space Station. They're, I think their map pool is really solid. I think they're good. 
as time goes on. They have been in the past, and maybe it's a little bit different with Hot and Cold instead of Canadian. Maybe, maybe not. But I'm gonna take I'm gonna take Space Station. So uh, Space Station over Empire, BDS over Furia, Dark Zero over Team One, Team Liquid over Damon Kia. Liquid over Dark Zero, Space Station over BDS, and Space Station over Liquid. So I guess that's my predictions. Um, we'll see. Uh, but regardless, I think these are going to be really, really good games. I'm especially excited for the Space Station Empire game and the Dark Zero Team 1 games. And not just because of NA, but uh, I think Furia and Damon Key are probably the two weakest teams in here. But sure, certainly no slouches. So it should be fun. I'm looking forward to it quite a bit. Let's see what happens.